Hi, I'm Susan McLennan from Babel on Communications. And one of the questions I sometimes get is, how can organizations improve ethical decision making? First of all, you have to ensure that it's being demonstrated from the top down. There's no buy-in from the company if it is being demanded of people at a particular level, but it isn't demanded at the top. That's the first thing. Second of all, you need to be uh, ensure that everyone with suggestions is actually heard. So if they have a, a contribution towards better ethical decision making, that they can be heard. And you really have to make it clear that ethical decision making is important to the company. You want to make sure, too, that people have enough time uh, and and compensation for the tasks that they are assigned, that's when people tend to cut corners, is uh, when they don't feel that they have enough of those things. You can also consider an ethics audit, and that will help look at the gap and close the gap, hopefully, between what the company says its ethical stand is and what its practices actually are. Um, I think also it's important to uh, tell people that they should think of every action as if it were going to be spread across a newspaper or a recording played back somewhere. That's very helpful just in terms of grounding people in their own thinking. If this were splashed across the newspaper, if this were played on a tape recorder, how would this look? And lastly, I think you really want to start rewarding ethical decision making and letting people know who's been awarded for that because people will see that and they will want that for themselves. We reward people for short-term profits. We need to reward them for long-term thinking that will lead to better profits. I'm Susan McLennan from Babel on Communications. Thanks very much for watching.